In a developing story this morning, police in Florida are now designating the boyfriend of a woman who vanished during a cross country trip a person of interest. So Northport police are now in day five of an urgent search for Gabby Petito. Authorities released new body cam video following an incident between Gabby and her boyfriend, Brian Laundry, as officers responding to a 911 call about an urgent uh, an argument, excuse me, outside a convenience store in Utah. Petito uh, allegedly hit Laundry in the face. The scratch is evident on body cam video. So officers say the incident seemed to be more of an emotional break than a domestic dispute. Put it on me in the car before. And then Why wouldn't he let you in the car? Because <laughs> you have your OCD? Told me I need to calm down. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm perfectly calm. Sometimes I have OCD and sometimes I just get really frustrated. Now, no charges were filed. The two agreed to separate for the night, but on September 1st, Laundrie returned home to Florida without Gabby. Now, Laundrie is remaining silent. His attorney says they believe any statement he makes will be used against him. Authorities and Petito's uh, parents only have one question. There's one question that matters. Where did you last see Gabby? That's the question that matters right now. We need to know exactly uh, where he was, where she was, their last location. So uh, Petito was last seen August 24th, checking out a hotel, out of a hotel with Laundry in Salt Lake City, Utah. Her mother says the next day was the last time she spoke to Gabby, who told her they were on their way to Wyoming to check out Yellowstone.